Solar sailing is a game changer. In another stepping stone for Indian Space Research Organization. Well, it has been seven years since NASA launched its mission to collect samples of asteroid. Elon Musk's SpaceX is on the verge of making history with this groundbreaking technology. But what's the real game changer here? Imagine a satellite that doesn't need constant refueling or thrusters to stay put. Yes, you heard that right. No engines, no fuel, just the power of light. That's the magic of the solar sail. Think about it this way. Imagine a telescope stationed in space, keeping an eye on asteroids zipping near Earth. Or picture a satellite perfectly perched above the North Pole, needing to maintain a fixed position indefinitely. Doing this with rocket fuel? Not practical at all, according to the science maestro Bill Nye. Imagine a satellite the size of a loaf of bread drifting through space, fueled not by traditional means but by harnessing the force of photons, those tiny packets of light energy we get from the sun. The brainchild behind this innovation? The Planetary Society, an organization devoted to advancing space exploration, was co-founded by the legendary astronomer Carl Sagan. And guess who's leading the charge? None other than Bill Nye, the science guy himself. But here's the kicker. This concept isn't a recent epiphany. Back in the 1600s, Johannes Kepler mused about sailing among the stars. And now, centuries later, his poetic musings have transformed into reality. So what's the magic behind this technology? It's not futuristic gadgets or mind-bending advancements. It's a square sheet of ultra-thin film. Mylar, a polyester brand from the 1950s. This sail, less than the width of a human hair, is a reflective, lightweight powerhouse covering an area of 32 square meters. Picture a sailboat cruising on the waves, its sails billowing in the wind, propelling it forward. Now, imagine a spacecraft equipped with a giant reflective sail instead of an engine, harnessing the power of light particles called photons to push itself through space. This concept is called solar sailing. When photons, the tiny particles of light, collide with the reflective sail of a spacecraft, they impart a fraction of their momentum to the sail. Think of it like a game of cosmic billiards. The photons bounce off the sail, transferring their energy and causing the spacecraft to move in the opposite direction. It's a bit like how when you throw a ball, the force you exert propels the ball forward, but your hand moves backward. This gentle but continuous push from the photons accelerates the spacecraft. Now here's the magic. Unlike traditional rockets that need fuel to generate thrust, solar sails utilize the never-ending stream of photons emitted by the sun. As long as there's sunlight, these spacecraft can keep sailing without the need for traditional fuel. This makes them akin to a perpetual motion machine in space. They don't run out of fuel because they're harnessing the constant flow of sunlight. Bill Nye, the science guy, simplifies this further by highlighting three crucial factors. Shininess, size, and weight. The shinier the sail, the better it reflects light, maximizing the push from photons. A larger sail captures more photons, resulting in a stronger thrust. Additionally, a lighter spacecraft means it can be propelled more efficiently by the momentum transferred from the photons. The thrust generated by photons may seem tiny compared to traditional rocket engines, but the key here is its sustainability. Once a solar sail-equipped spacecraft reaches orbit and unfurls its sail, it can keep gliding through space using the perpetual stream of sunlight without the need for refueling stops. This opens up exciting possibilities for long-duration missions, exploration of distant celestial bodies, and potentially revolutionizing space travel by enabling missions that were previously impractical due to fuel constraints. Solar sailing is a fascinating concept that merges simple physics with an incredibly innovative approach to space travel, offering a glimpse into a future where spacecraft can traverse the cosmos fueled by nothing more than the light from the sun. Well, Japan's space agency had a go at this in 2010 with Icaros, the concept remains largely untested. But the time for this romantic idea has arrived. Bill Nye echoes the sentiment, hoping this technology catches on like wildfire. What powers this miniature marvel? A colossal polyester solar sail that taps into the endless energy of the sun. Meet LightSail 2, the trailblazer following in the footsteps of its predecessor, LightSail 1, launched in 2015. But even pioneers hit a few bumps. 
Lightsail 1's mission was a brief one, facing a handful of glitches while testing the sail deployment. Not to worry, because Lightsail 2 is here to set the record straight. Now let's talk numbers. At a mere $7 million, Lightsail 2 is a bargain in the realm of space missions. And its mission? A whole year in orbit. This is more than just a test, it's a game changer in the making. Bill Nye, the science enthusiast leading the charge, isn't keeping this incredible innovation to himself. He's all about sharing the joy of space exploration. He's inviting universities and businesses to join in on this revolutionary technology. Imagine a few days after the rocket takes off from Kennedy Space Center. Lightsail 2 starts its show in space. It unfolds its solar arrays and then opens up four triangle-shaped sections to create one giant square sail. It's like watching a mesmerizing cosmic origami unfolding in the depths of space. But wait, the sail isn't the only hero here. While it's busy catching the sun's energy to move the spacecraft, there are also trusty solar panels on board. They handle other essential jobs like taking pictures of space and making sure the satellite stays connected to Earth for communication. So, in this space spectacle, the sail takes the spotlight for its unique role in propelling the spacecraft using sunlight. It's like the wind pushing a boat forward, but instead of wind, it's light from the sun. Meanwhile, the solar panels multitask, using sunlight to power all the other vital functions of the satellite, like a high-tech Swiss Army knife keeping the spacecraft ticking along smoothly. This tag team of the sail and solar panels showcases how innovation in space technology isn't just about one flashy feature, it's about combining different tools to make space missions possible. Bill Nye's mission to open up space exploration means more minds can hop on this cosmic journey, contributing their expertise to propel humanity's reach into the final frontier. Enter Lightsail 2, the celestial dancer around Earth. It's not just a passive observer, it's climbing higher and higher, all thanks to something amazing, solar radiation. This energy from the sun gently pushes the sail, turning it into a powerhouse for propulsion. But that's not all. What's next for this groundbreaking tech? Get ready for deep space exploration. Sure, it starts off a bit slower than spaceships with engines, but here's the kicker. It keeps on accelerating. Picture this, sailing through space, slowly but steadily gaining speed until it's racing at mind-blowing velocities. Imagine a future where stars aren't just sparkles in the distance, they're actual places we can reach. Lightsail 2 isn't just a satellite, it's a doorway to a whole new era of space travel. And guess what? This is just the start. Now here's the super practical bit. Those tiny particles of light called photons. They're unlimited, which means the sail keeps moving without needing constant refueling. Bill Nye makes it clear. To stay still for 10 years, you'd need an insane amount of rocket fuel. It's just not doable. And here's a cool bonus. You can spot it from Earth. Yes, with your own eyes. Imagine looking up and seeing this incredible feat cruising through the sky, a real-life marvel of technology and cosmic adventure. So picture this bright future, satellites stationed effortlessly, telescopes scanning the skies, all without the headache of constant adjustments or refueling. It's not just a leap in technology, it's a leap into a whole new era of space exploration. And guess what? It's just the beginning. Hold on to your seats, folks, because we're about to witness the power of photons charting a new course through the cosmos. So, as the countdown begins and the Falcon Heavy rocket gears up to launch Lightsail 2, history is about to be made. It's not just a satellite, it's a testament to human ingenuity and our ability to sail through the cosmos, powered only by the brilliance of light. And that's a wrap. Share your thoughts in the comments below. If you enjoyed this content, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more.